I requested the bind and fly EX120 for FreeSky. This means it comes with a FreeSky compatible aftermarket receiver based on Medelic's work in the RC Group's forums. This receiver is usually tucked in here underneath this panel, but that makes it a little bit difficult to get uh, to the bind button and it tucks the antenna in here inside of all this uh, carbon fiber, making it a bit of a pain in the tuchus for uh, uh, radio reception. As a result, I moved it here to this arm so that the antenna could be well clear of the carbon fiber and uh, allowing me easy access to the bind button. This receiver binds in D8 mode, not the free sky default of D16 mode. This means that when you go to bind this unit, what you have to first thing you have to do is hold the button while you're plugging in the battery to force it to go into bind mode. When it's in bind mode, the green light is lit solid. I know that's unusual. Usually it's blinking on other models, but that's just the way they did it on this. Then, Welcome to you go into your Tyrannus, select the menu, or excuse me, select the menu page for that model, and then you go into the channel mode selection here. And change it from D16 to D8. Now, you scroll down to the bind, hit enter, and in a minute you will see the green light go out. Now that that is done, you can exit bind mode and now it is connected. Power cycle the quadcopter. And you will see that the quadcopter is now receiving. However, unfortunately, um, the flight controller is not configured for FreeSky channel order. So that's going to be our next project, getting in there, connecting it to it, and adjusting the, th the channel order.